good morning and welcome back to the vlog as you can tell from the title this is a weekly reset slash sunday reset i love prepping for my week on sundays so i figured why not just go ahead and vlog it anyways i just finished doing my morning gratitude Ooh, the sun is speaking out i'm so excited i'm so excited because it's been raining here in hawaii for the last literally like two to three weeks and the sun is finally coming out you guys and i'm so so freaking excited as i was saying i just finished my morning gratitude i wrote on my five minute journal i think i'm gonna go ahead and get ready just a little because i want to do some errands and i also want to go get groceries today i typically like to do my groceries on the weekend whether it be saturday or sunday whichever whichever day i'm usually free and this time we are doing it on a sunday which i don't mind because i feel like that's completely resetting and prepping for the week before i go ahead and change let me show you my pajamas of the night of the day i have my brandy melville top i love this because of how baggy and boyfriend it fits like it's as long as this so i can sleep with just this oversized tee which i typically like to do and then i have my sweatpants which is also from brandy novel i freaking love these sweatpants guys i live breathe in these sweatpants i have so many of these i have this wet one i have a gray heather one i have a dark blue one i have a um black one but yeah so this is my little pajama of the night good morning i'm so ready today to have a nice kind of intro to spring few days in my life it's the last week of february but i'm Alrighty guys, I just finished getting ready and right now I'm actually about to look through my recipe collection on TikTok because whenever I watch TikTok and I come across a recipe that I would like to try, I save it into a little album. So I have all of these recipes that I potentially could cook. So I'm just going to go through them and kind of like see what I feel like cooking this week because one of the things that I told myself at the beginning of the year and also in my I believe February reset is that I want to try cooking new recipes and I also want to get acclimated with Filipino recipes because I love Filipino food one of the Filipino food recipes that I really really want to try to cook is sisig so I texted my dad and I was like hey can you please give me the ingredients and steps on how to make sisig so I might also go and get the ingredients for that today we'll see what i'm kind of feeling but i definitely want to try making seasick this week <music> all right so here's my grocery list we have target and then costco Alrighty guys, change of plans. I think I'm going to get most of my groceries, if not all of my groceries, at Target now. Um, Costco is still closed actually and I already went out of the house. So I, I'm just going to go ahead and try to get everything at Target um, and we'll go to Costco some other day. But I feel like all the things that I was going to go to Costco, I can get smaller portions from target and it's completely okay and i kind of just like want to make a one-stop shop maybe two and that's about it and costco doesn't open for another an hour and a half <laughs> guys we got the groceries done which i'm really really happy about i got water because it's so hot and i've been dehydrated all day all right hello guys i just got home from target um i'm gonna do a little target haul first things first i just got water because i was really thirsty couldn't wait anymore i got these really basic boyfriend t-shirts um and they were only like nine dollars and they remind me a lot of the skims boyfriend tee so i got this in a size small and it's still pretty oversized and i got it in this brown tan khaki color and then i also got it in white and i also don't have like 
conservative tops if that makes sense like i have a lot of tank tops i have a lot of crop tops but i don't own like full coverage tops and i feel like these are perfect to just chill in and i can use them at the beach um, as a cover-up or just to run errands and then i got another one of the tube tops and also this brand was having a 20 percent off sale so instead of this being five dollars it was only four and i'm actually wearing the white ones so now i have two whites and two blacks and i don't mind getting multiple of these because i honestly wear them every single time and they've been my favorite tube tops um to pair with overalls um or i can just like wear them by itself so I also picked up Yakult because they're really good to have, especially in the morning. I got some ground beef for tacos. I love tacos, guys, so I just keep them stocked up. I got cilantro. I didn't know that Target doesn't sell, like, chicken breasts. Like, or did they just, like, run out? I don't know. Like, when I went in, they didn't have any of them. Then I picked up these Hawaiian Hose Matcha Max. These are so freaking good, you guys, and they're never in stock at target so i kind of went a little crazy and got four these are so yummy and they're probably like my favorite favorite flavor so if you haven't tried them get them while you can i got salt because i'm running out i got parmesan cheese for the chicken alfredo pasta that i want to try i got some gum to keep in my car in my purse and wherever i got cajun seasoning to put a little bit on the pasta I got some honey for my little lemon ginger and honey tea. I got Old Bay seasoning. I feel like this one is always nice to have in your pantry. And last but not least, I got some, I can't believe it, it's not butter. And this is for, honestly, pretty much anything and everything. So, yeah, those are everything I have. I'm so happy to be home. And now that we're home, I'm just going to go ahead and put these away. And then we're going to get to deep cleaning the house. As you can see, I have some plates and pans and spoons over there. Those are all clean. I just dry them up overnight. So I have to put those away. And then I want to vacuum. And then last but not least, I also want to do laundry. Don't mind the mess in the background as I've been filming a couple of brand deals, but I'm going to go ahead and pop on and listen to a podcast. I'm going to be listening to Erica Taught Me, and if you guys have TikTok, you probably have seen her videos. Her podcast episodes are so insightful, and I feel like this is the perfect time to do it so I can get in the zone and, you know, get my work done, but also, like, I'm learning and keeping my brain active at the same time. <laughs> second load already and i have to do a third load and since i'm doing a deep clean in the house i am also washing all of the towels and the rugs on the floor so they're all clean and fresh i also like to wash my pillows weekly it's just better on the skin and i love fresh new sheets and pillowcases <music> I just finished deep cleaning the kitchen, the living room, and also the bedrooms. I'm just gonna warm my leftover pork and peas and rice that I got from the food trucks yesterday. It was from Lala's BBQ, which is like a Filipino food truck. I've been craving it since this morning, so I'm gonna go ahead and eat that. And after lunch, I wanna do my nails. So we're gonna have a little self-care because my nails are all grown out right now. We'll see if I can get this out, soak them in little acetone, if not, We'll have to see. 
Today is Sunday, meaning um, tomorrow's Monday. I like to plan out my week on Sundays as much as possible. I like to write things down on my planner, whether it be video ideas that I want to film this week or any meetings or calls I have to take, or if I'm meeting up with a friend for lunch, dinner, or maybe like game night, tennis, whatever it is. I like to jot that down. And then I also like to transfer all that information onto my Google Calendar. I love having a digital calendar, but I also really like having a physical like planner calendar. So I'm just gonna go ahead and plan my week. I have a very exciting collaboration with Skims, which is so crazy. Like I've never had any problems with the pieces that I got. Like I own maybe like eight of their rib tank tops and then five of the little cotton jersey t-shirts and then a couple of their long sleeves. I honestly love it. So to be working with them again for the second time, and I say second because I worked with them when they first came out. So it's just super exciting. And this time I'm working with them on their swim drop. I'm also going to be doing dinner tonight. I think I'm having tacos again. I know you guys have seen me cook the tacos, but we're just going to go to do it again because I've been craving tacos for the last couple of days. And I finally have the ingredients since I went out and got it. And, you know, why not? Why not? So, yeah. I don't know why I'm out of breath, honestly. I mean, to be fair, it's been a full day of just cleaning. since I last vlogged but I ate some dinner I just had some tacos and then I also showered I was gonna do my nails in my room but it's too dark so I've decided to do it outside while we watch aquamarine because today is the 17th anniversary of aquamarine this is actually my first time doing a little removal step process for press-ons usually I just pop them off so I think the first thing you have to do is to file the top coat there's like a shiny part on your press-on and you have to file that so I'm just filing it with the nail file that it came with I just finished filing my nails this is what they look like it took quite some time and I used three different nail files but I'm gonna go ahead and pour some hot water in here and then the acetone on top so I can have my hands soak in for 15 minutes. Update, here's what my nail looks like on one hand. I did scrape off some of them already. I wish I had a drill right now. Um, I do have a couple of glue all over my hand, but they are so cute and honestly I had to do this thumb twice because it was way too big But I'm glad that I changed it because this size is a lot better I think I'm gonna go to Target today and buy a white top coat because the top um, Of each nail is kind of rough because of the glue I'm gonna kind of just like want to smoothen it out, but this is what it looks like honestly so freaking cute 